Hello, 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 and welcome back to And Then There Was Style, your home decor channel. If this is your first time here, definitely take a moment to subscribe to our channel, become part of our home decor family, and also catch up on some of our previous videos. You guys, I have a ton of stuff on this channel just waiting for you to go and take a gander at. But in today's video, you guys, let's talk about a high-end, luxurious pantry. And of course, before we get too into it, don't forget to take a moment, go ahead and join our Facebook group at And Then There Was Style. Also follow us on TikTok and Pinterest, And Then There Was Style. I am really making myself be way more social on these social media sites. So anytime that I am not on YouTube per se, you guys can still come and hang out with me. So I would really, really love that. So let's get into the video. Now, most of us really feel that the kitchen is really the heart of the home. It's a place to gather and be nourished and eat good food and just talk and unite with each other and bond where there is always warmth and comfort to be had. But for those with particularly passionate flares for culinary joys of feasting and entertaining, a well-appointed pantry is an absolute must. A lot of older houses often boast impressive walk-in pantries, offering a glimpse of just how crucial these utilities were for early homeowners when going out to eat and having all these restaurant options weren't as common as they are now. So modern layouts don't really, you know, allot quite as much space and care to the pantry. However, there are numerous, numerous ways to re-implement this timeless necessity. But today we're going to be looking at luxurious pantries. So when you look at a, a lot of luxurious homes, you see these really sprawling pantries and I am just honestly obsessed with it. I mean, many of today's pantries cleverly utilize unused nooks and corners and crannies and closets, while larger installations create basically an extension of the kitchen itself. So a lot of the images that I am showing you are both luxurious pantries as well as a butler's pantry. But more on that in a moment. The perfect pantry allows for optimal storage organization and infinite shelf capacity to hold all of your goodies. Whether you're looking for a full-scale walk-in, a more space-conscious cupboard edition, the kitchen pantry of today understands what the modern homeowner wants. So I said we would get more into a butler's pantry, and this is something that you may see, you just may not know what the specific term is. So a butler's pantry, also known as a scullery, is a room or area between a kitchen and a dining room traditionally found within large homes, but increasingly more homeowners are opting for this smart storage solution. A butler's pantry serves two main purposes, storage and staging. So you may ask, what is the difference between a pantry and a butler's pantry? A butler's pantry is essentially a really super sized steroided version of a walk-in pantry. Where many walk-in pantries are really nothing more than just kind of a small closet off the kitchen. Butler's pantries are generally a small room that features cabinets and countertops, meaning you can expand your kitchen storage space tremendously. In a lot of butler's pantries, you'll see wine coolers, you'll see a microwave, a second stove, a second refrigerator. And, and that second kitchen, a lot of times you look at it like, eh, why, why do I need this? But just think, if you're in a large, luxurious home and you're entertaining, a lot of people that can afford that home don't want to be in the midst of cooking right there with their guests or they hire professionals that come in and do the cooking 
and that way the professionals have their own separate room or area to conduct all of their you know culinary goodness that they're doing in that room and they're not in the midst of all of the guests that are being entertained So when opting for a large, luxurious, beautiful pantry in your home, there are a couple of things to consider. First off, what is your budget? I feel like that is probably one of the most important things to go ahead and pinpoint first so you will know exactly which realm that you are working in. You know, if your budget is $10,000 for something, you know what materials you need to look at you'll know what your layout should be. You'll kind of have some set structure and guidelines so you're not completely thrown off at the end. Also, you have to think, is this a show pantry? Are you just mimicking something that you've seen on Pinterest or Instagram or YouTube? Or is this some functional pantry for you? Are you a prepper? Do you like to accumulate large amounts of dry goods and other items to have when you need it? All of this has to be pre-planned and thought out first, so therefore you'll know how to lay out your cabinets. You know the shelving units you need. You just kind of have an idea of all of this already planned out to make your pantry as useful as possible for you. Alright guys, so as always, as we near the end of this video, take a moment, let me know what you thought about this video. Is having like a really luxurious pantry something on your want list in your home? I know as people downsize, having a big pantry is not a necessity or even a want or need anymore. But those of you that still have a need for it, is this something that you could see in your home? I love the look of a really nice curated pantry. I think it's gorgeous. But a lot of the pantries that I see, especially the more luxurious ones, it's almost like a showcase. And I'm like, no, I want it for real food. I want to see spaghetti sauce and spaghetti and chips and cans of soup so I can see how it would really look. But tell me down below in the comment section, what do you all think? Alrighty guys, so I've already asked you to comment your favorite pantry down below in the comment section. Now if you wanted to know mine, I actually love this tons of space for kitchen appliances and foods and you know, I don't want one of like a, an Instagrammable Pinterest pantry. I want a, a real pantry and I feel like I can do a lot in this one right here. As always guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, share it with other home decor lovers, and subscribe. Also hit that notification bell. I will see you in the next video. Bye friends.